Hey, what's up, y'all? So, I'm here at church and uh, having a little Facebook message conversation with a friend of mine. And it kind of got me fired up, so I'm outside, kind of pacing, and I thought I should get these thoughts out because um, I think this is really important. Not just, not just because it got me fired up, but because I think it's a principle that just jacks with people and it screws up their lives. It screws up the lives of their friends and their families. And really everything that they do just gets messed up by it. And it's this idea um, that your belief in something has any effect on its truth. Or that you somehow can determine what's true by what you believe in. It comes from this idea of, of determining what's true for you. Like I, I'm just trying to figure out what's true for me. There is no true for you. All right? There's no true for you. There's true and there's not true. And that's it. And just because you believe in something or choose to believe something doesn't affect its truth at all. Just because I believe in a God doesn't mean that there is one. It just means I believe in it. Now, whether or not there is one is a totally separate question. But just because you choose to believe something doesn't make it true. And that goes any way that you want to... Just because you don't believe in God doesn't mean there isn't one. Just because you've decided for you that there isn't a God, that, that there isn't one. You can't, you can't spend your life thinking that just because you believe or don't believe something, that that somehow affects whether or not it's true. Because the only thing that is true is that truth doesn't depend on you. At all. Things are either true or they're not, but, but whether or not you believe in them is totally irrelevant. And to live your life with the assumption that just because you believe something that it's true, you just you, you, you destroy all reason, all logic, all rationality by, by keeping yourself so in such a narrow frame of mind. It's, it's incredibly arrogant and it's ridiculous to think that f for some reason, oh, this is, the, this is what I've chosen to believe and therefore it's the only thing that could possibly be true. No! No. You can believe whatever you want. I really don't care what you believe. I mean, I don't, honestly. I, I'm, I got enough of my own stuff to worry about to care about what you believe. But to assume that what you believe is what's true just because you believe it, it's ridiculous and it bothers me. I don't do that. I believe things, yeah, but I don't assume that they're true just because I believe them. I've actually had to make some sort of faith leaps, I like to call them, where there's things that I can't really logic, even, even, I can, I can make some logical connections, but I, I, have to make, I have to draw a line in the sand sometimes. But that doesn't make it true. It, it doesn't. You'll never hear me say, well, this, you know, this is the case. Except for things that are, are obviously true, logically true. Like, truth doesn't depend on you. <laughs> that is true, because it's a logically sound statement. You can believe whatever you want. But that doesn't affect whether or not it's true. And whatever you choose to believe or not believe is, it's totally up to you. But it, stop assuming that just because you believe something, that it's true. That's like the, that's like, it's like pouring yourself a glass of water and then not drinking it. You, you just, you can't do that. You, you can't. I'll say it one last time. You're allowed to believe whatever you want. And frankly, I don't really care what you believe. But the truth of the matter is, your belief doesn't affect what's actually true. So stop assuming that it does. That's it.